about the Mac. Oh, my nails. My nails are like falling off. Okay. So next, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna talk about the Mac acrylic liner. My nail is so ugly. Oh my god, it fell off. Sorry, I'm getting my nails done tomorrow. Ooh. Okay guys, so let's get started. So the first thing that I'm going to use is um, the Inglot liner. It is my number one favorite, like I said. And I'm going to take it with my MAC 266 brush. It is a very, very angled brush. And I will zoom you guys in a bit. But as you guys can see, I have used this from a previous application yesterday on myself. And what I like to use is my um, Cinema Secrets Pro Cosmetics brush cleaner this stuff is definitely heavy duty i have used this before in my favorites i did mention it in my favorites but i like it because it really gets the job done so what i have on my lap is i have a towel um i noticed that the only other thing that will clean the brush is baby oil but the reason that i mentioned the cleaner is because the inglot one is very very heavy duty and um, it really makes the brush stiff. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna clean it like so on just a small raggedy hand towel that I have on hand. What I'm gonna show you guys today is how to get that fierce fleek liner. Um, but also, the number one thing in doing a winged liner or fierce brows, mostly liner, is the most important step and it is to pray because there are just those days I don't know if it's just me but you know how you just have those days where it's sometimes a bad makeup day or a good makeup day or a good liner day per se so yeah okay guys so I just finished cleaning my brush and this is the MAC 266 I like it because look it is very skinny and it is angled so I know a lot of um whoa we're too close and please excuse the pimple on my face right here um how ironic that I really want to record an eyeliner tutorial and then this little bitch pops up but anyways we are going to use the Inglot number 77 liner and this stuff is amazing it does dry super fast so what I like to do is like let's say this is the table whenever I'm using the liner I'm going to open it for you guys I like to store it down so it doesn't get um dry dried out so this is how i store it whenever i'm doing clients or for myself just make it a habit if you have any gel products or cream products um when it comes to doing makeup it's all about what you're using it why you're using it and and most importantly how you're using it so when i go in and take my liner i'm going to Coat both sides of the brush. I don't know if you guys can see this. And I'm sort of edging it off to the side to get that fine point. And like I said, I'm going to store this really fast. Okay, this is really, really close. So what I'm going to do is I have my little handheld mirror by Candy Lover 89 This mirror is so cute and it has like a little light as well. Isn't that cute? Focus, bitch. Hello, focus. Okay, perfect. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with the brush at this angle right here and stick the point on the inner corner and start sketching out lines. Short strokes. And it's okay, you just really want to just build as you go. And then the other trick is, is that you see I'm going this way. I'm going to then flip the brush and then I'm going to go from this angle. Right here. I think like with everything else with makeup, it just, I think you just have to build up experience with it so don't be discouraged and as you guys can see like I'm gonna show you guys really really quick I'm holding the mirror down here I'm not holding it up here because if you guys have more of a monolid 
it's good your lid's gonna touch and I don't want it to touch so I like to stay looking down so my my lid is very um, relaxed and it is very um, smooth so I'm just going to build the liner even more and you see it's a little bit jaggedy that's fine okay this is the part where you want to pay attention because you see my waterline right here my waterline is going up so you want to follow as if this is continuing up towards your brow so as if this the the shape of the bottom waterline is going to continue I'm just making like a little flick just like that and that's it you don't have to go any longer and then I like to go with the longer part facing down coming from the inner from the outer corner of my eye going up then I like to flip the brush and then I like to not go from the very end of the tip just like a little bit before it because that line is going to act as our, our wing and then I'm going to go down just like so It is so hard to talk and do this. Right there. I hope I, I'm in focus. So what I'm going to do is I picked up some more product and I'm just going to fill in the gap and then see the lengthwise side of the point on the angle brush is towards the outside because I'm going this way. And then I'm going to go this way. So go down. And this part right here is where you can smooth out your text is where you can smooth out your liner and you see guys I'm just gonna fill in the gap just right here I'm just gonna clean it up. and there's the wing I'm gonna zoom you guys out so you guys can see <laughs> you guys on on Instagram Twitter and Facebook please follow me I connect with you guys on all social media platforms because um, I didn't know whether I want to do the wig or the turban but for the sake of the tutorial I did the turban in the beginning but now since it's the end of the tutorial I thought I would just show you guys what it looks like with the wig on for those of you girls that are interested to see what this makeup might look on you if you have the same skin tone or complexion but um you guys liked my last tutorial with the valentine's day with sandra that with the wig that i thought i would bring it back um i like the turban you guys the turban keeps me cool <laughs> gives me like a little facelift um check out my tur turban tutorial if you guys want to see how i do it um i'm wearing two wigs um, maybe I'll do that in another tutorial on how I stack these. It's super easy. Um, but this is what the wig looks like. I know you guys have been begging me to do this tutorial with the wig, but um, here it is. <laughs> but um, anyways, I love you guys so, so much. Thank you guys so much for commenting and supporting me. And I just never got the chance to say thank you so much for 100,000 subscribers and it's just truly truly amazing I would like to, to go more into it into detail I'll probably do like a makeup makeup journey or makeup story or how I became a makeup artist or something like that but anyways I just want to let you guys know that I appreciate every single one of you I love you guys so much like you guys have changed my life you guys have have just helped me with my confidence and with my um, just with me as, as a person and, and I'm happy that I get to share my platform with my brothers. I, they're my best friends. I love them. And I'm glad that you guys get a little sneak into my life with my brothers and my makeup and a little bit of who I am. So with that being said, please um, 
check me out on Instagram, on Twitter, and on Facebook. I even do Snapchat here and there, but Twitter and Facebook, I am more so active to commenting back to you guys. Um, tweet me. Um, Instagram is just a little bit crazy because um, I can't see all the comments, but definitely on Twitter and Facebook for sure. So please check me out on those platforms. And also, if you guys want to see more videos of me in the wig, please comment. I mean, um, please subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. I love you. Bye. I'm going to put them on, okay? Four, but like, if you were to use like a cream, which one is that? Is that mine? Oh my god. And how I'm using it. No, 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 no. Start, start, Of course, there are guests over at my house at this hour. <laughs> Filipino people. <laughs> oh my god, I cannot do this. Talk about the Mac. Oh my nails, my nails are like falling off. Okay. So next I'm gonna use, I'm gonna talk about the MAC acrylic liner. My nail is so ugly. Oh my god, it fell off. Sorry, I'm getting my nails done tomorrow. Ooh. Let's hide the nail. Let's hide the nail. Okay. Okay, and it's still showing. Okay. Let me just hold it halfway. Perfect. Okay. Why I'm using it and how I'm using it. No, 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 no. Start, start again. Start. Um, you guys can let me, let, let me get my life. I am stuttering in this outro.